Well, right now, the Department of Child Services is really under the microscope as an outside agency performs an audit. And now leaders of DCS updating lawmakers on their progress. Our State House Bureau Chief David Williams in the newsroom now with more on what he's learned. David, good evening to you. Good evening. DCS has new director, Terry Sigden. She's been on the job now for three months. So she sat with lawmakers to give them an update or progress report. 13 minutes after Department of Child Services Director Terry Stigden and CFO Leah Rader sat before lawmakers Tuesday, money questions started flying. Do we need more money or is the system broke? Or is it both? We do not need more money for fiscal 18. Um, and I think you were very generous to us in the fiscal 2019 budget when you gave us the additional 125 million in that. And as we continue to go forward, and I think to Terry's point about with the assessment coming out and understanding exactly what our needs are, that's going to drive a lot of our conversation. The Child Welfare Policy and Practice Group, a national nonprofit that works with states to fix issues in child care systems, is evaluating DCS. Sigden says that agency has already interviewed more than 350 people. The goal of the CWG report is really to uncover where we are as an agency, where we are vulnerable, and how we can improve. Sigden's also doing her own groundwork since taking over three months ago. She's visited roughly half of DCS's state regions. She plans to meet more field staff and shadow more case managers. And what I have found is that we have a lot of folks, not just in the field, but in central office and in other areas um, of the agency that are committed to helping children and, children and families. My main purpose is to really check the pulse of the agency and find out what barriers exist that may prevent them from doing the best job possible. One barrier lawmakers brought up, DCS's inability to keep quality staff. The attrition is not good, and that's the, reason, that's the reason I think that's the reason why we keep giving you money, because people come, they get the services or get trained, and then they leave because of the caseload. Stigden hopes to finish visiting all the DCS offices by the first week of June. She believes that'll be around the same time that CWG will be finished with their final report as well. I'm David Williams, live in the newsroom, 24-hour news 8.